Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. This is tech episode number one, and I thought I would take the time to show you the four phones that I have as of um, spring of 2015. So on the far right is the Nokia 520, then the iPhone 5S, the LG Tribute, and the Blue Vivo Air. Um, operating systems on those, I've got the Windows 10 for Phones Preview running on the 520, uh, iOS 8.3 on the iPhone 5S, Android 4.4 KitKat on the Tribute, and Android 4.2, or 4.4.2 on the Vivo Air. So I know a little bit about all three um, operating systems, my favorite being Android, recently just switched from my iPhone, which you can see is cracked, and I had gotten the Vivo Air um, for $200 off contract, which is amazing. And really, just taking a look at the device here, it is incredibly thin. It's like 5.1 millimeters thin, and that's just insanity. I've got the Apex launcher running on here. Looks kind of like uh, LG's UI, closer to stock Android as well. That's pretty cool. Um, definitely my favorite phone in this pile. Um, the LG. I had gotten to watch YouTube when my iPhone first cracked because I picked it up at Best Buy for $40. But um, it runs, you know, the stock LG GUI atop of Android 4.4 KitKat. Pretty standard uh, setup here. There's that. The iPhone. Oh, sad iPhone. Um, I actually tripped in my garage. That's why it is cracked. Um, but, you know, I don't have a problem with Apple or iOS or anything. I just like Android because I can customize it to however I like. And the Play Store is much cheaper than the App Store. So, yeah. Still love Apple products, just I've moved on from their phones. Currently recording on my iPad Air. And then we've got the ultra cheap, ultra buggy Nokia 520 running Windows 10. I have to say I'm liking Windows 10 on the phone as I've just kind of played around with it. But... It has so many problems, it's not even usable. Like, it is just impossible to do much with. I can't even get three apps to update. It's that bad. But, you know what? It's another operating system. I really like the Metro UI of Windows Phone. I've never had a problem with it. I know a lot of people do, but I'm one of those, I like it. My problem with it is there just aren't apps for Windows Phone. There, the app gap between Windows, iOS, and Android is huge. I mean, you really do get all the apps you want on Android and iOS. And then you go over to Windows Phone and... There's just nothing there. No Google services. Yet, you can get all the Microsoft stuff on your Android phone. That doesn't make any sense. And no official YouTube app for Windows Phone. Big problem. So, like I said, Android, my favorite. My favorite phone being that Blue Vivo Air. Really impressed with it. Um... Yeah, so one thing you might see running on all four devices is a pink smiley face. 
And that's something that actually started on Windows Phone. It is uh, now known as Mix Radio, formerly Nokia Music. And um, it's a music streaming service similar to Spotify or Pandora. But what makes it cool is you choose both genres and artists that you like, and it creates this great mix for you. And you get, it's free, you get six, six skips per hour, sorry. And um, to put it this way, this is how great the service is. I have never reached six skips in one hour. That's incredible. So, quick shout out to uh, Mix Radio. You can join the beta. Um, just Google search Mix Radio beta and you can get your hands on the app yourself. Um, for the future, I do plan on getting the LG G4 when that comes out. Really excited about that device. It's new leather back is amazing. Um, so hopefully I can do a review of that on this channel. And um, maybe a future tablet video, as you heard, I am recording on an Apple iPad Air 2. Um, I do have an iPad mini 2 as well with the retina display and upcoming I did back the Yola tablet on Kickstarter those should ship in July so once I have that I can do a tablet video featuring those three tablets so definitely give this video a like if you like seeing my phones including the cracked iPhone and um, Definitely hit that subscribe button to see more from me and this channel and to get notified when I have a new tech soda. So hopefully this is a series that I can keep doing on YouTube and hopefully you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.